So we need 10 frozen spiders. To get it, you need to buy the ice rod if you don't have it. The ice rod is obtainable in Jerry's workshop. However, it is not on right now. So if you don't have it, the only way is to buy it from the auction house. Due to high demand, it is pretty overpriced right now. Now, if you haven't already done so, go to the bazaar and buy a few stacks of spooky bait. This is mandatory for getting the frozen spiders, as we will be fishing them with the ice rod out of the water. So you want a few stacks, as you, the drop rate is not 100%, and it is a treasure. So you want to go to the spider's den, and go to the pond following this path. A tip to get frozen spiders as efficiently as possible is to not use your fishing armor. This is such as shark scale armor, diver's armor, etc. As they boost sea creature chance, which is not what you want, as frozen spiders are considered treasures. So instead you want to boost your fishing speed to get more chances of getting frozen spiders. To increase your fishing speed, you can use the flying fish pet or the ammo knife. So after some time, I got a frozen spider. It is a good catch, so it is pretty rare. However, you do, if you do it right with ice rod and spooky bait, it should be correct. There is a problem where the frozen spider will take a while to load. To solve this problem, you want to double click on the frozen spiders to reload it. So after you have gotten 10 frozen spiders, you can go to the hub. Then go to the alchemist where he will give you the great spook staff, which is the texture pack of a dead bush. Okay guys, thank you for watching my video on how to get the Great Spook Staff. It will be highly appreciated if you can subscribe and like, as I'm getting very close to 100 subscribers, and I want you guys to help me get to it. Only 1% of my viewers are subscribed, and that's really sad. So help me please change that.